Monster Energy Supercross 5 here. We are here. It's been a long time. I've been waiting for this game forever. We're going to do a single event here on Houston 3. 20 minutes plus one lap. This race is going to be absolutely insane. It's our first race on the game. Here we go. I've been waiting for this for months. I'm sure you have too. Monster Energy Supercross 5 has arrived. Let's do it. Gate is down and we are racing in Supercross 5. Welcome to our first look video. Will we get our first hole shot? First hole shot in our first race. Let's go. Here we go. Um, this is our first look video. Welcome. We got the hole shot here. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. And we have it. We have it all the way up already. We have realistic difficulty. Uh, realistic AI. Um, advanced physics. And we are pulling away from these guys. I mean, there's no way we win this race. I'm just telling you that right now. Um, here we go. Man, I'm so glad. Uh, I'm, first of all, I'm so glad it's not 1 o'clock in the morning or something. I am on the West Coast. And apparently this game came out... Uh, 12 a.m. Eastern time, so that would be 9 o'clock uh, Pacific time. So, very thankful that I don't have to stay up till that time. But hey, we got a battle here, our first battle here in Supercross 5. Man, this game's been a long time coming. Like, man, like, I'm telling you, I've been waiting a while for this game. Here we go. Man, you know what? I I I know there's a lot of people out there that says this game is Supercross 4, but with updated tracks and riders. And so far, as far as I could tell, no, it's not. This is not Supercross 4 with updated tracks and riders. This is a little bit updated. It's very similar to Supercross 4. I'm not gonna lie, it's very similar, but it does feel a little bit different. It feels like looser if that like like if supercross like i'm not even like people are trying to comment out there that this game is similar to oh 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 boy that will happen but a lot of people will say that this game is similar to like supercross 3 uh kind of um it's kind of similar to Supercross 3, but it's also not, you know? It's like, it's like a mix of Supercross, it's like, it's not even like a mix of two games. It's like its own thing, it's very weird. Like, take Supercross Physics, I, I mean Supercross 4 Physics, and put, uh, like, make them looser. That's what this feels like. This feels like a very loose version of Supercross number 4, and that's not a bad thing because Supercross 4, uh, physics-wise, is my favorite. Is Supercross 4 my favorite Supercross game? No. Uh, and there's reasons because for that. But like I said earlier, this game has the potential to be the best Supercross game in the series. And so far, I'm enjoying this game. Like, we're only four minutes in this race, but I'm enjoying this. Um, the AI, though... They're kind of trash on this track, so maybe I should have picked another track. Anyway, Chase Sexton and Martin Davos are going at it. It's not like we're, like, uh, miles ahead. You know, like, I, I'm going to be honest. This was my third take on this video and because I messed up a bunch of times. But my first take, I put it on assisted physics and medium difficult. Oh, damn, Chase, and that, Chase Sexton just annihilated his life back there. Anyway, I put I put it all on assisted physics and medium difficulty, and I uh, blew everyone's doors off. And I wanted an entertaining video, and so this is realistic. Di oh damn! This is realistic difficulty, and we are definitely gonna have a challenge on our hands now. Oh, oh, wow! Ken Roxon just absolutely annihilated me, and we are really getting we are getting beat up now. Man, but hey, me and Ken Rotson going down there, that's kind of like a, a foreshadowing to a upcoming series here on this game. But yeah, this so far 
feels different than any of the Supercross games I've played, which I've played all of them, so. And it's, like, different. Like, I, I don't even, like, know how to explain it, but it's different, you know? Oh, man. We were, like, I, I literally just said, like, we're destroying the AI, and then they just, I made a mistake there, and they just came back on me. See, and that's, this is also one thing that I absolutely love. I'm loving about this game. I saw it in the gameplay, and it's clearly in the real game now. Here, um, my favorite AI in a milestone game is MXGB 2021 for the fact that they got super spread out, and you could actually lap guys, which lappers in motocross races are a thing. Like, oh, well, you could still ride on people's heads, I guess. But like lappers and motocross races were a thing. And we saw last year at this track, we saw a lapper ruin a race for someone. I'm talking about Ken Rocks and Dean Wilson, that situation. So like, it seems like we may hit lappers here. Um, yeah, at least so far. But um, at least the leaders might hit lappers. I don't know if we will. But yeah, this game's fun so far. Like I'm having a good time with this. We are there it is 13 minutes remaining here in this race and as you can see un, uh, as you can see Tomax on a Kawasaki here and he's number one you know why because this game is based on 2021 and that's why we're not racing Anaheim one that's why and oh Barsh and me go down that's why we're not racing any of the Anaheim races that's why I mean I've said that many times but I'm sure People are still going to have questions. If you have any questions about this game, uh, as I'm filming this, it is currently like 9 o'clock California time. What a jump. That was huge. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions down below, I will, I will eventually get to your questions. Just leave them down in the comments below. But yeah, this game so far, I'm getting absolutely annihilated by this AI. Like... I'm not that great at the Supercross games. I'm, uh, su I struggle sometimes, and you know what? That's the same here. I'm struggling hardcore. But you know what? Sometimes it's okay to struggle. Like this is my first race. I need to like chill. What did I expect to win? Hell no. Anyway, Chase Sexton might win our first race here in this game. But 12 minutes remaining here. Um. Eli Tomac, number one in this game. Uh, this is going to go down as his final year on Kawasaki. This is not going to go down as his final year with the number one plate because he's about to win the 2022 Supercross Championship here. And yeah, just in case you wondering, I am a big Supercross fan. Like, I catch the races every weekend. Um... And yeah, I'm actually excited because this weekend in Indianapolis, we actually have the track editor contest winner from Supercross 4, which literally just copied Houston 1 from this game. So if you played Houston 1 on this game, I know I will, especially in our Ken Roxon Championship. Um, yeah, um, whoever made that track, you just copied Houston. I'm not liking that turn after the whoops. Look at that. Barsh is on a gas gas. So it made me create a custom rider. So uh, this is not like the tutorial race. This is just a race I set up here. Look at that. You could actually do the line. That was actually the line there. I just gained a bunch of time. Uh, this line right here was triple, triple. Can we get them triple out? No, we cannot. But yeah, the line... Um, anyway, what was I talking about? I was talking about something. I just completely blanked out. But yeah, like, I remember, uh, back in the, back in the, back when the first game, some of the first gameplay came out. I remember I talked about these tracks and, man, these tracks aren't going to be good. They look hor horrible. But as far as I can tell here, I'm actually doing the real life lines, like, other than this wall jump line, like this is a cheater line right here, but their actual line, actual line was this, and then some people tripled, but most people doubled there. But yeah, this rhythm section right here, this line was double, 
triple double and you could actually do it in this game and I really like that this line right here this was a triple 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 you could actually pull it uh, I'm not pulling it right here but yeah these lines are actually realistic like this on off is realistic and then here this is all realistic too you come to the inside and double triple you've seen me do it in this race before but like yeah you could actually do that so this game is actually like it's got as far as this track I haven't played any of the other tracks yet this is literally my first look at this game ever uh, I didn't even get to go to any of the races this year for real life supercross and test this game out this is literally my first time playing this but yeah you could actually do some of the lines at least on this track so I know I was worried about the track but it looks like we're good here we're sitting in ninth I don't remember what did Tomac get this race last year like fifth or something I believe I think so yeah here's this triple 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 oh the AI is missing it so we're gonna get a lot of time on these guys wow can we pull an Eli Tomac beast mode charge here in our first race yeah here's this double triple oh my god are we actually gonna pull a beast mode charge here on our first race wow I'm actually gonna go for the win here oh yeah Malcolm Stewart's back in the game so yeah riders in the game I could I stay to the end of this video I'll show you everyone who's in the 450 class at least um, but yeah Malcolm Stewart's back in the game um, maybe uh, if this is my Ken Roxon championship successful I'll do a Malcolm Stewart championship as well um, I think Tonight, I'm going to do an Eli Tomac championship just on my own so I can get used to this game here before I start my Ken Roxon championship. But, oh boy. Is that, that is that the leader up there? Oh, no, that's Kenny up there. Ken Roxon got up to second in this race. That's pretty good. I know, I know this is just AI, but I take this kind of seriously too. But, yeah, I'm going to for sure play. And if you want to see, like, a certain rider on a certain track in this game as like a certain uh, separate video just let me know down in the comments below and I will for sure do it uh, I'm planning on doing a full review on this game um, on Sunday or Sunday or Monday of next week um, so yeah my point is I'm gonna have a lot of videos coming out on this game so if you enjoy this kind of content this uncut raw content please subscribe to the channel um, yeah, it just helps me a lot, and yeah, at this point, I'm trying to make YouTube my job, so yeah, we fell back in the pack a little bit, but we can easily come back. These guys are all bunched up here. Look at this. They can't get the triple-triple. Oh, no. Wow, it reset. Okay, another thing I like about this. You see Anderson right here? We're catching him. We're pretty much right here. Um, they pretty much just copied him. Oh, wow. We are really having a bad race here, but uh... They pretty much just copied Jason Anderson from Game 4 into Game 5. They just like hit copy and paste on that. So if they copied one thing from Supercross 4, it's Jason Anderson. Literally, look at look at Jason Anderson in the fourth game and come look at him here. It's literally the same. But yeah, I think like the lead leaders are going to laugh some people here. But yeah, I, I kind of get bored with... Um, like other people's videos like oh wow I kinda get bored with other people's videos because like all it is is like them pulling away like make it realistic like this this is realistic racing right here like maybe because they're just good at the game and I just refuse to admit that I'm horrible at this game literally this is my first first try here on this game so yeah oh Brayton just annihilated his life okay Chase Sexton is gone he is winning this race dude the Honda HRC guys are dominating this I know I know this is just a video game but still I'm taking this seriously can we take out Marvin Muscan here wow we are actually battling here in five minutes to go oh we bombed him off the track that was awesome See, 
See, it seems like Roxon and Chase are like so far ahead. Oh! Brayton just took me out. But like, it seems like they're so far ahead, but look at that. Chase just went by the other lane, so they're not that far in front of me, you know? There's Cooper Webb, the 2021 champion. Um, oh, look at this! Look at this! Oh, wow. I'm sure like the fast guys are going to quad that section for sure. But yeah, if you want to see a certain rider on a certain track for a, cert, uh, for a race in a video, just let me know down in the comments below. Like, for example, go like uh, Justin Brayton Daytona or Adam Cienstro at Arlington 2. Something like that. So just let me know and I will definitely get to it. Uh, yeah, just let me know down in the comments what you want to see in this game because I have a special privateer edition video coming here later uh, today and then I have a Ken Roxton championship coming next week so yeah a lot of content coming with this game I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, do the track editor contest this this time this game and I actually have a track planned out so it's not like I'm going into it blind so yeah whatever you want to see in this game just let me know and make sure you subscribe because we're gonna have a lot of content here that's for sure I'm gonna be busy here between my real job and now my real job and this I'm gonna be very busy so yeah just subscribe and let me know what you want to see on this game and I will definitely get to it eventually we have three minutes left uh oh oh can we not die here in this first race there we go we got around Jason Dude, they like completely copy and pasted him. That's hilarious. Can we triple out? Yes. That's right. Oh, dude, he's doing the Vince Freezy line. Ban him. Oh. Honestly, this ain't bad at all. I'm not doing horrible at all. Like, there we go. See, the AI is so terrible at that line. Forced to go out outside there. There's Chase. There's Kenny, and then wow, it's like we make up so much time, but then we if we like miss a rhythm, you dummy. Anyway, if we like make up so much time doing that triple, 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 but then like if we miss something, then like we're doomed. Like we're going back to like eighth or ninth. So like look at this, we're in ninth, but like watch when we get to that section over there. Oh, Anderson just died. Watch when we get to this section right here. Um, this triple, triple, triple. So, like, look at it. We're in eighth right now, but triple, double. But these guys are going to miss it. We're going to probably get it here. Yeah, look at it. These guys missed it, and we completely caught them. So, that's, a, that's an area where you can make up time. Oh boy. Oh, one minute remaining here. Yeah, look at you're actually ha hit hitting lappers in this game. That's pretty cool. Yeah, those guys are completely missing that rhythm section. I don't know why. Look at Triple, triple, triple. Yeah, we got that section down. Can we get at least a top five here in this race? Dude, it's kind of hard to hit this inside line too. Like, I'm trying to like put you guys in my shoes of what I'm experiencing here here so I talk about the physics at the beginning of the video and I'm pretty sure everyone's tuned out already but like this is a battle right here I'm starting to get I'm starting to get the hang of it though don't get me wrong 
Brayton is all over us. Oh, Dino! Who knows? Maybe he'll go back far enough where he'll just mess up Chase X and I don't know. Oh! Wow! Oh, okay. Now we're falling apart here. Where's the leader? Where's Chase? Okay, so same sound effects, but look at this. Oh, we almost had it. We definitely gained some time there, for sure. Oh, remember the heat race in this race where Barcher just completely hit Alex Ray and costed him a heat race win? Yeah, Barsha was never supposed to have the red plate in this round. Like, no disrespect to him, but he wasn't. Roxton should have had the red plate in this round in real life. And let's be real, Roxton should have won this race in real life, but Dino happened, so. Alright, let's see if we can try to pass these guys here. Apparently, Chase Sexton didn't get to the finish line in time. Wow, this race kind of went quick. If I'm not, if I'm not, like, if I'm being completely honest. Oh, we went down. We're not about to get beat by Alex Ray here. Not Alex Ray. Oh. Oh, is that Kyle Chisholm? Okay, there's the final lap right there. See, these guys, like, completely spread out. This is, like, this is, like, what we want to, this is at least what I wanted to see in this game. These guys actually spread out, because it, it definitely looked like from that first gameplay that these, that was going to happen, and it for sure has happened, so. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. Like, this game has so much potential, and in, so far, it's really impressive. Like, anyone who's hating on Milestone at this point, like, just stop. Just stop. If you, like, please, in the comment section below, please let me know why are you hating on these Milestone games. Like, I don't get it. Like, this one's actually different. Like, they actually, like... I, I could see how people could say like, oh, they don't know anything about the sport or something like that. But like, you know what? Maybe they haven't touched a bike, that's for sure. But hey, there's the winner. But they for sure are trying. Like, come on guys. Like, if it wasn't for Milestone, we wouldn't have these games. So yeah. We're coming in the end here. Chase Sexton just crossed the line. I'm sure he lapped people. No, we're not about to get beat by Aaron Plessinger. Or Max Anstey. For sure not Max Anstey. Oh! I didn't think I was going to get that double. But yeah, I'm liking this game so far. Even after one race. We'll see how my opinion changes next time. Because I'm definitely going to play this game quite a bit here in the next few minutes. But yeah. 16th in our first race. Not ideal. But thank you all so much for watching. Let me know what you think about this video and this game in the comments below. And I will see you in my next video on this game. So far, I'm loving this game. Let me know what you guys think about this game in the comments below. See ya.